Just make sure you watch each other's backs in the storeroom. Wouldn't want to lose my loyal customers. Oh, very well. To business. Was there more to discuss? Yep. Um, I know it's not my business, but if I were you, I'd wash off that symbol painted on your neck. We were told it would help protect us. Was that a lie? Oh, no, it's a protection stave, all right, but you can't render that pigment into paintable texture without blending it with boar urine. And is that really better than death? Maybe a little. Well, well it's your neck. <laughs> Sindri, have you always been so... Clean. Huh. Don't I wish. No, I was just as unsanitary as the next dwarf. Today, a banner witch set me straight. She discovered that the magic of thousands of tiny beasties on everything around us. Ugh. So small you can't even see them. No. It's true. And if they get inside you, they make you sick. But the witch told me there's one wood, the oak, that's a natural deterrent that stops the beasties from spreading. So now, I make all my handles from oak. See? I hate these things. Okay, back to work. So how come Brock's blue and you're not? Boy. Oh, it's fine. Very good question, actually. You see, my brother's not as careful as I am. In fact, he prefers to work with metals using his bare hands. <sighs> no gloves. Says it's the only way he can hear what it wants to be. Touch enough raw silver and it changes your skin irreparably. That means forever. I wouldn't bring it up to him, though. <laughs> Come, boy. I see with the eyes of a child. In war, a soldier sees beauty only in the blood of his enemy. The rest of him is lost. Sometimes never to return. You know about war, don't you? Wars are fought for two things. Survival or advantage. Battles may be won by the better soldier. Wars are won by those who are willing to sacrifice everything to ensure victory. That's why she didn't want to cross. She told you. Well, I could just feel what she was feeling. What she was afraid of. Hmm. It happens again. You tell me. Understand? I promise. Exist in the same space, one on top of the other. 
It's like this room lets us travel without moving. Came back from another realm, and we met your brother. Wait, not that order. Did you let that seed saw put hand to your blade? Hmm. You do know he lost his talent, right? Just up and left him one day. <laughs> Tried taking me down with him. Hmm. Did he botch up on a girl? Quite the opposite. Yeah, leaving a blind pig farts up a truffle now and again. But you know what really counts? Consistency. And I got that coming out of all of my parts. What did you do? It's better. Good. Now when you're done gawking, I got a favor to ask. What is it, dwarf? There's this alchemist on Vari, been working out in the Velander mines. You haven't heard from him in maybe, I don't know, a hundred winters or so. Probably dead, but uh, maybe you can find him. He's dwarfing like me, wears a fancy green ring, owes me a favor. You look? If it is on our path. Oh, I see how it is. I need that alchemist for something I'm stewing up for you. Do you remember the way back to the Black Breath? Of course. We need to walk across the bridge to the Vanaheim Tower. Are we going to the Black Breath? Or exploring? Your choice. Did you see something out there? That tower! I see no tower. Maybe I'm seeing things. I wish we could have gone on a trip like this with Mother. She could fight, couldn't she? Yes, she fought beautifully. We can beach over here. Look here. Okay. That's going in the journal. Scare up that alchemist what needed finding? What realm you gents shaking off? Let me guess. All fine? How'd you guess? I'd know that smell anywhere. Used to spend my fair share of time there, but uh, I ain't allowed anymore on account of the uh, incident. What happened? Well, ain't too sure your daddy's gonna like me talking about it on account of all the swearing and stealing and fucking involved. What? Don't judge me. You're the one came in all reeking of elf. Stirs up a man's memories. 
Go on now. I got things that ain't gonna hammer themselves. What it'll it be, shorty? Anything else for you? Later then. So, Rock said his friend was dwarven like him. Wearing a green ring. If you wish, I will be gathering resources for our journey. You don't want to help him? Dwarven, but no ring. One of his crew? Scorch marks. There, along the floor and wall. Weird. I guess we keep looking. We? I mean, I'll keep looking. What? Attack. Oh. Mom made them sound more dangerous than that. Then do not drop your guard. Come. Huh. Not him. Hey! I thought you didn't care. I noticed the lack of ring while losing the body. We're not going to find Brock's friend alive, are we?
Atreus, follow me. severed hand attached to the soul eater well we know what happened to Invari now we can just go tell Brock no need to fight it right no we'll fight it but why because you are frightened of it Strong, Atreus. Stay focused and look for a weak point. Yes, sir. Stay quiet. Make no sudden movement. 
Strong, Atreus. Stay focused and look for a weak point. Yes, sir. Stay quiet. Make no sudden movement. Strong, Atreus. Stay focused and look for a weak point. Yes, sir. Stay quiet. Make no sudden movement. Stronger than you know. Thank you, Father. Let's see if that's the alchemist win.
green ring. Dwarvish inscription. The alchemist. But where's the rest of him? Ashes, most likely. The soul leader got him. I guess we should bring this back to Brock. Read it. Yes, sir. The runes were written fast. It spells out... The Jeem Stain. Hmm. I don't know that one. We will ask the blue one. And now you're interested? We have found his alchemist. A reward was promised. What'd you find? Your alchemist. I'm sorry, Brock. The hand is all we could find. Still wearing the ring. There was a soul eater inside. And, well, it must have burned away the rest of him. Suppose you'll still be wanting some compensation, huh? Naturally. Naturally, he says. Miani Peruxi. I'll take a closer look at this here ring. Maybe Anvari left a bit of magic inside for he croaked. Dwarves can do that? Sure, dwarves and magic jewels is like flies and pig lips. Supple ones. Ugh. I'm not as interested as I thought. Make you something? Keep them from hacking bits off you.
So, uh, you sticking around for grains of wisdom? What does it say? Yes, sir. Uh, these runes read death inside. Boy. Know any good stories to pass the time? What kind of story? I don't know. Mother always had stories. Weren't you told me when you were a boy? There was a man I knew long ago. His stories were brief and purposeful. Sounds fun. Do you remember any? But set that aside. We must proceed on foot. Can we finish later? Perhaps. Magic is still covering those scorn poles. Saves us some time. Just make sure you watch each other's backs in the storeroom. Wouldn't want to lose my loyal customers. Sindri, why don't you just make up with your brother already? Me? Make up with him? Because he's an obstinate pighead incapable of change. Because he says the most... Come, boy. Right behind you. still down there if you don't feel like climbing.
Father, do you do you think I could get here now? No. But I I said no. Okay. Carved the face in the mountain. You would know better than I. Thanks. Now watch our step. Carelessness will only delay us. Right. We see if the witch was right. It's working. She was right. Come, let us finish this. Then we climb. You know, Mother said the giants used to visit the Midgard Mountains before they disappeared. Disappeared? Yeah, I guess they just up and left one day. No one knows why. Perhaps they return to their home. Jotunheim? Maybe. I wonder if the face in the mountain is a tribute to some important giant. Mel, we made it! More black breath. did come here. Is that a deer? I don't remember stories of a giant with a deer head. I wonder who he is. Prepare yourself! must have been important to the giants. It's like they're testing us. Okay, that looks right. What does it say? No yoked beast, nor fearful thrall, nor rooted tree, doth know my call. Is it the answer? Freedom. Sure, that works. Go ahead. Sure. Ross. What you doing? Oh, 
thought maybe there'd be a bridge. Huh. Your giants mean to test us further. There's a crystal in that torch hole. Should I light it? That helps, right? Guess we have to go down and go up. These passages seem too small for giants. <laughs> Why do you laugh? Oh. You're serious. I am always serious. I forget. Mama always said we never took an interest in history. Giants are just a race, like elves and older folk. It doesn't mean they're big. What of the world serpent? Okay, in that case, giant also means big. There's only one. better at this. This is a lot of bodies. Tell me what you see. Well, they look like men, not giants. Correct. Be you seeking treasure? See the traps? Oh yeah. Lucky for us, they set them all off. Be grateful we stay dead. What does it say? Oh, this is Durothron, one of the four stacks of the world tree. He's supposed to watch the entrance to Yonan while we try and sleep. Isn't he still there? I do not know.
Look here. Sir! I've seen this language before. <laughs> Still our goal. We find a way up. Deep in the realms. Think Mom knew this of the Giant's Mountain? No. The request has been more complicated than she could have foreseen. It's a name, I think. Brasley. It means terror. What's that? Weird. Well, a candle all tangled up with string and some sort of animal hide. Some kind of lantern? There's no width, though. That is of no use to us. The Bifrost lights our way. Hey, what do you think let these torches? The dead don't need light. Uh, eyes open. Claw reaches the summit. Our goal is near. See how this works. The claws on one side, and if we get this unstuck, oh, oh no! I think the rope stuck under that rock. That was careless. Yes, sir. Sorry, sir. find our way up through there. After, you know, getting rid of those things. Yeah. 
You had a way around the Black Breath all along. Now don't go thinking I could have gotten you past it, you big sack of meat. I got ways around most everything, especially up here. Time was, my folk had the run of this joint. Improved the design of the Jotnar traps and built workarounds to boot. Why you think they're so devious? Oh, that reminds me. Watch out for traps. Now you're talking. Always a pleasure. Now fuck right along. Wow. How big is this place? It is a mountain. Big. More traps. There's a tunnel, but you won't fit. Take it. Okay. I see that. If it is not useful, leave it alone. Look! 
Another lantern. Broken. Leave it. What could they be for? There's something special about them. I can feel it. It's working. That's a good idea. He might snap the rope. Still need to free the rope. Think you can use the cart to get us up there? Give us the way to the top.
to the wheel. all the way to the top? We will see soon enough. Something feels strange up there. We're heading into danger. Do not concern yourself with what might be. Focus on what is, and be vigilant. Yes, sir. Not the top, but we're closer. There's a note. A giant's prayer. They're asking their ancestors to watch over them. To guide them home. Boy. Wait. I think I know how it works. Watch. them to watch over mother. Do you think they'll watch over us on the way to the top? Come boy. It is a long way up. Whoa! What's Stay back! The tunnel boy. around the giant's traps. Good thing, too. Well, good for me, anyway. Oh, come on! That is not helping. be as long a way up as we thought. A 
Atreus. I'm fine. Just lost my balance for a moment. You know, for someone so strong, you sure worry a lot. It serves me well, and how I keep us alive. I guess. Not a terribly fun way to live, though. Here we go! Is this where we get off? No, we are stuck. How much farther do we have to go? I do not know. Think we'll get attacked again? Definitely. Oh boy. Yes, now be ready.